Gilman reporting for Katie Chats here at Brooks Army Mingle for a Mission in downtown Toronto with Stephanie Ann Mills and Vanessa Matsui. How does it feel to be here at Mingle for a Mission? It feels amazing. This is like, you know, such a huge feat for Amanda and it's really exciting. It's such a great cause and I'm really honored to be a part of it. Yeah. Yeah, so happy to be here and I mean, I mean it's it's neat too because there are, there are some people that we've only been in contact with via Twitter, so getting to meet some of these great people yeah. in person is really exciting. Yeah. What is the importance of helping children with disabilities to you? Oh my goodness. I mean, helping anybody with with disabilities but especially children like I can't even imagine having a child and going through all the tough things and just seeing kids they're so innocent and it's uh, it's such an important thing to support like really truly very important I think yeah yeah I, fe I, I feel mean, like what, it's how a, can you say that, exactly I mean, it's it, so yeah. obvious it's such an amazing amazing facility and they do amazing things and I mean, there's no doubt about that. I mean, I just got chills. Like, yeah. I mean, we've met some people and it's just amazing. It's amazing what a little bit can do to help and yeah, can't deny that, that's for sure. Yeah, you know, even when I, I grew up in Toronto and I remember part of like phys ed uh, at my high school, one of, one of the field trips was visiting um, the rehabilitation center and it had a really big impact on me when I was a kid and just, and, and also, you know, safe practice, like yeah. don't, don't, don't get in a car if somebody's drunk because there are, you know, there are consequences to that and, mm -hmm. and it was just, yeah, it was a great place to, you know, to learn, learn how to be safe and open your eyes yeah. when you're younger and see, and have see a what of, other people go through absolutely. too is a huge yeah. eye-opening thing. Like mm -hmm. these kids are such huge survivors and they've gone through so much in such a little amount of time that like their strength and their courage is so completely infectious and it's astounding. It's really like hats off. <laughs> Absolutely. What do you think of the concept of combining mingling with your friends and co-workers and also supporting such a terrific cause at the same time? Oh my gosh, easy, seamless, so much fun. <laughs> I think best day ever. <laughs> I think it's nice because then it makes it a bit more casual and you can enjoy yourself and you can really yeah. get to know some of like even the people on Twitter that come and like the kids that come and just the people who are out to support unanimously the same cause is such a beautiful thing. Yeah. And you ladies have had a terrific year. You're both on seed. What has been the best part of that whole experience? Well, I'll let you answer that first. <laughs> You know, honestly, I feel like I've, I guess I've been acting almost like, I mean, eight years, eight, and it, it's, we work with an incredible group of people. I mean, from the cast to the crew, to the creators, it, it's, it's a really special experience because not only am I very proud of the work and I think that we're definitely offering something uh, different as yeah. far as Canadian programming goes, um, but also just to go to work with awesome people and, and you your know. your job is to make people laugh yeah, it's the best. with funny material <laughs> and have a good time and you just, I know personally my experience, all I do is laugh on that show. I, know. I mean, all you do is you just have so much fun and it's uh, just amazing people working together and having a great time like what yeah. a job we have yeah so lucky yeah I feel yeah. incredibly so grateful yeah. Yeah. <laughs> almost every day yeah. yeah and what is the importance of Canadian film and television to you hmm. oh my goodness um, go ahead <laughs> well I think that it's always important I mean storytelling is something that's universal right and it it's, it's a part of how you share what your culture is and who you are as a people and Canadian film and television is so essential because that's the way that we tell our stories. I think, you know, because we're beside this, beside America and they have a thriving film and television industry that it would be very easy to get, to get lost in that mix and, you know, I, I love America, I live there sometimes, but there... Canada is different. We're we're a different country, and I think we have we have different values that is important to represent in our media. And it's also important to celebrate how different we do stand out because a lot of the times I think as Canadian actors we really like dumb ourselves down. Mm. And I think that it's like celebrate this great comedy that like just for instance this comedy or like shows like Lost Girl who you'll meet people from Lost Girl and yeah. <laughs> all these Orphan Black and like all these amazing shows that that are 
just, you know, Canadian. Yeah, we have something to offer. Absolutely. And I don't think we should ever um, throw that under the rug because I think what Canada has to offer is really special. Absolutely. Yeah, we're Canadian. Right. Yeah. <laughs> and where is the best place to follow each of you online? I guess Twitter right now. Yeah, yeah. Twitter. And what are your Twitter handles? I'm at S underscore A underscore Mills. <laughs> Um, I'm just at Vanessa Matsui. Perfect. Yeah. Oh, that's Thank you, you that so one. much, you. ladies, no and have an amazing time mingling Thank this you evening. So Thank you so much. much. Thank you for nice having me. Thank you. <laughs> I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats. You're at Bruges Army Mingle for a Mission in downtown Toronto.